In this work, we use reinforcement learning to synthesize a tracking controller that drives a robotic system towards a pre-planned reference trajectory. We formalize the problem as a Markov decision process that also captures the evolution of the reference via randomly sampled actions. Unfortunately, RL scales poorly with the size of the underlying MDP, making it difficult to perform the exploration needed to learn high-performance policies. In particular, the agent must choose the appropriate action for all possible physical and reference states. Therefore, it's helpful to share experience across all equivalent state action pairs. For example, this space robot's dynamics do not depend on its absolute position and orientation, and neither does the error between the physical and reference states. In fact, these two configurations are related by a rigid body displacement acting on the actual and reference states simultaneously. In this work, we leverage such symmetries to reduce the dimensionality of the tracking control problem via an MDP homomorphism, thereby accelerating training and improving performance. For many robotic systems, the dynamics and reward of the tracking control MDP enjoy powerful Lie group symmetries. In particular, if two state action pairs are related by an element G of the symmetry group, then after propagating them through the dynamics, the post-transition states will also be related, perhaps by some other element G prime. Moreover, the reward can easily be chosen to also be invariant to this transformation. We use these continuous symmetries to construct a continuous MDP homomorphism, exactly projecting the track and control MDP to a lower dimension. The value equivalence and policy lifting results of Planogadin et al. imply that an optimal policy for the low dimensional MDP downstairs can be lifted to an optimal policy for the high dimensional MDP upstairs. We apply the approach to three physical systems and compare the result with a symmetry unaware baseline. After the same number of training steps with the same hyperparameters, we see a clear improvement in sample efficiency during training and zero-shot tracking performance on pre-planned reference trajectories. For a point mass controlled by an external force, we show that the lift of a policy that observes only the position and velocity error performs better than a policy observing the full state. For the NASA Astrobe, a free-flying space robot with SE3 symmetry, we show that a policy that only observes the pose error between reference and actual states outperforms a policy that observes these poses separately. For the quadrotor, an aerial robot whose SE3 symmetry is broken by gravity, we show that an observation which replaces the reference and actual poses by their pose error and the gravity direction in body coordinates outperforms the baseline full state observation. We show that a symmetry-informed approach to learned tracking control improves generalization, sample efficiency, and final tracking performance. We hope that these insights will guide RL practitioners in the development of high-performance trajectory tracking controllers for complex robotic systems.